hi uh, this is another uh, quick video to uh, show you another method uh, for sin flood attack on previous video i took you through uh, how you can do sin flood attack by using metasploit uh, in this video i am using another tool called hping uh, using the same scenario uh, so i have one virtual machine if i take you through this scenario uh, da, 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 da. I have uh, Windows 7 running on a VM and I have Kali Linux running. So what I want to do is uh, to attack from Kali to this Windows 7. Uh, just to show you uh, at the moment nothing much running on my uh, Windows 7 and um, you can see this is the uh, processors use. Uh, once we run the um, attack then we will see uh, the change in processors use so let's move on to kali uh, if i open my other browser this is kali uh, if i make it bigger uh, the tool i'm using now called hping3 um, very fast i will request you to read the help for hping3 as i suggested a uh, number of times uh, you want to learn kali always use help so from here you can see all the um, options you can use how you can use hping in details uh, what i want to use um, actually i want to make it very simple i want to use uh, hyphen a or minus a uh, probably to spoof the ip address or probably um, just to have your own ip address of the attacking machine and i want to use do, 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 uh, i want to use s so uh, here i want to use hyphen s uh, for sin flood attack see uh, this particular tool you can use to you for a number of other attacks but uh, for this task i will take you through only the sin attack and um, for that purpose i will have to use hyphen s command so um, if I type a simple command, this is, uh, let me clear the screen so that you can uh, see this better, clear. So, I'm using this command, hping3, to run hping. I'm um, giving this parameter, hyphen s, uh, which will do the sin attack this is my target machine um, sorry uh, this is my source machine so firstly i'm giving my source machine or attacking machine uh, this is my kali machine i gave this ip but i could give a different ip as well and um, this is my uh, destination machine or victim machine what i'm expecting uh, to get down after this dos attack um, I'm, uh, I need to give a port number. I hope you remember from my previous tutorial. So firstly, I did uh, in map scan. I uh, try to find out what are the ports which are open. And from the previous scan, I knew that port 135 is empty. So I'm saying send this sin attack on this particular port. And um, then I'm just saying do a flood attack. Once I'm done, press enter and you will see uh, no response from here kind of it will say that um, you won't be having any reply now if i take you to the other screen of uh, my windows 7 just to see okay okay so straight away you see my windows 7 has uh, jumped um, in terms of processor use if I open the washer, uh, that will give us a bit better picture. So I open my local area connection and straight away you see this is the source machine, what I mentioned there. And this is the destination machine, which is um, uh, our uh, Windows 7. Okay, come on. It seems like my Windows 7 is already done. So uh, from Wireshark, I can see source is what I said my source is. And this is the destination, which is a Windows 7 machine. And all the um, uh, attacks are coming onto this port 135. Um, you will see that this is RST and a couple of other information you can find from um, this particular piece of information. More time you spend, see it is um, started um, 
uh, started taking more and more resource from RAM. So if you leave it for a couple of hours, uh, it will give you a successful DOS attack. So quick recap, um, one of the simplest way how you can use uh, hping is uh, just use your Kali, uh, run the command hping3, select your options, whatever you want to. I just chose a simplest one, gave the attacking machine's IP, gave the target machine's IP, uh, which port I'm targeting, and then flood. Done. Okay, thank you.